Good morning, Ben Franklin. Happy Wednesday. Happy April Fool's Day and a very happy birthday to Logan. I'm so excited to celebrate Logan today. I hope you can join us at one o'clock to do his virtual birthday snack. Um, that kind of goes hand in hand with our writing today. You're gonna be writing about one of your favorite foods and maybe you could bring your favorite food to our virtual birthday snack. I can't wait to see what you all pick. Um, yesterday, I had the chance of video chatting with some of you and it was so fun. I saw a lot of stories that you wrote from home. Um, I saw um, some books, some of you read me some books that you had at home. I even learned a little bit of sign language it was fun to see you and I'm going to see some more of you today and tomorrow. Um, if you haven't yet, this is something you're going to need help with from mom or dad. If you haven't yet set up Raz Kids, that's something that you're going to want to try to do today. Let me know if, if you need any help with that. Um, before I let you go, I thought I would do a read aloud as part of my morning greeting because it's the first day of April and it's a pretty special day. It's April Fools. So I have the book, April Foolishness. Check out the cover. And the back, sometimes the back picture gives you a little clue. It doesn't connect, the pictures don't connect. We always like to look at that, don't we? April Foolishness, ooh, look at what the illustrator did. They use the two O's as the glasses. How creative. Maybe that's something you could try in one of your stories with a double whammy O. Life on the farm keeps a gal on her toes. That's what grandma thought as she flung on her clothes. She grinned for the grandkids and had come for a stay. And wouldn't you know it? They picked the right day. Grandpa, oh Grandpa, the cows have got loose. I think Big Brown Bessie just stepped on a goose. Loose and goose, they rhyme. The cows are, ouch! Look at that talking bubble. You look at like the zigzags around it too. It almost is like those words are hurting coming out of the mouth of the goose. Interesting. Imagine, said grandpa, good graces, alas. Then he poured some milk in a tall, frosty glass. Glass and alas. Grandpa, oh, Grandpa, the chickens are out. They're squawking and squabbling and racing about. Imagine, said Grandpa, Amazing, oh my, as he popped some eggs into the skillet to fry. Grandpa, oh Grandpa, the pigs broke the gate. Hmm, now does Grandpa seem worried about anything that's going on right now on the farm? I wonder why. They're in the tomatoes. Oh, hurry, don't wait. Imagine, said Grandpa, I'm really quite shaken. He reached in the fridge and he got out the b bacon. Shaken and bacon. Grandpa, oh Grandpa, the goats are all freed. They're 
running around in a smelly stampede. Ooh, freed and stampede. Lots of rhyming words in this book. Imagine, said Grandpa, it's really quite scary. Then he sliced the goat cheese that he bought from the dairy. Scary and dairy. Grandpa, oh Grandpa, the sheep are all gone. I heard that they're munching on somebody's lawn. Gone and lawn. Ooh, one of them's drinking lemonade. Imagine, said Grandpa. I hope things get better. He opened the closet and got out a sweater. Better and sweater. Grandpa, oh why won't you listen to me? The farm's going nuts. If you'd look, you would see. But Grandpa just grinned as he took out the bread and he popped in some toast for his breakfast instead. When Grandma appeared, what a hullabaloo. Who's causing this noise? Noise, the grandkids or you? It's nothing, said Grandpa. Ignore them, I say. They're trying to trick me. It's April Fool's Day. Day and say. But honey, said Grandma, you'll find to your sorrow it's not April Fool's Day, but tomorrow. Uh-oh. Sorrow and tomorrow. Oh boy, now they've got a problem. Then Grandpa turned red and he gave out a roar. He sped through the kitchen and dashed through the door. Grandma just smiled as she pulled up a stool. She nibbled his toast and she called. Oh boy, what do you think she called? April Fool. Oh my goodness. I wonder if some of you are going to have a few tricks up your sleeve today. Oh, look at that. Grandpa has got a nice smile on his face, even though they played a silly little trick on him. Happy April Fool's Day, guys. Enjoy your day.